Welcome to How To Dino. Today I will walk you through the Auto Mod module. Before we start, please keep this in mind. Auto Mod ignores the owner, server mods, server admins, and protected roles. Meaning, these users cannot trigger Auto Mod. Now let's head over to the dashboard and navigate to the Auto Mod section. Make sure the Auto Mod module is enabled. The Enable Auto Mute option will allow Dino to auto mute members when they trigger Auto Mod. The Disable Default Banned Words option will turn off Dino's default banned words list. We will return to this later. The Log Channel dropdown will allow you to set a channel for Dino to send Auto Mod events. A typical Auto Mod log will include the user who triggered Auto Mod, the trigger text, and the specific filter the user triggered. In this example, I will set my log channel to logs. The auto mute timer option will allow you to set the length a user should be muted when they trigger auto mod. Please remember that the length is in minutes. The max emoji option allows you to set the maximum amount of emojis a user can send in one message before they trigger auto mod. The set minimum for this option is 3. The mute violation count option allows you to set the maximum number of times a user can trigger auto mod before getting auto muted. So if you have this value set to 2. Users in your server will only get 2 chances to trigger auto mod before getting auto muted. Please keep in mind that there are active cooldowns in place. So if the user hasn't triggered auto mod in some time, their chances are reset. The mass mention count option will allow you to set the number of mentions a user can send in one message before triggering auto mod. The set minimum for this option is 4. The link cooldown option will allow you to set the cooldown length before a user is allowed to send another link. Please remember this length is set in seconds. You can also set ignore channels and allowed roles. Both of these options will allow users to bypass auto mod. The settings gear icon next to each of the filters will allow you to customize the specific filter option. Meaning, everything changed within this prompt will only affect this filter option. Setting disabled roles and channels is the equivalent to setting ignored channels and allowed roles. Both the mute violation option and unmute time will only apply to this filter option and nothing else. So if you want Dino to mute users longer when they use a banned word, you can set the longer time length here. To enable our filter options, we must select what we want Dino to do when it detects a trigger. You can either have Dino delete the trigger text, send a verbal warning, auto mute the user once they hit the mute violation count, or you can have Dino perform all three. To remove an option, simply click on the X next to it. The other filter options pretty much contain the same actions. Here's an example when Dino is only set to delete the trigger text. Here's an example when Dino is set to delete the trigger text and send a verbal warning. And here's an example when Dino is set to delete, warn, and auto mute. the mass mention filter option. This filter option can instantly ban a user when triggered. Please remember this option is based on the mass mention count field. Here's what the verbal warnings looks like for each of the filter types when auto mod is triggered. Now let's set our banned words. Make sure the filter option is enabled by selecting an action. Let's move over to the banned words tab at the top. Here, we can see our default banned words list, which we can disable on the previous page. As you can see we have two different types of banned word options. We have wildcard and exact. The wildcard option is a bit more aggressive and will look for banned words within sentences and even other words. The exact option will only look for banned words within a message. Now let's add our words. 
In this example, I will add the word nap as a wildcard option, and the word Tesla as an exact option. Let's see how Dino handles the two. As you can see, Dino is picking up the trigger words as it should. Remember the word nap was set as a wildcard option, and Tesla was set as exact. When the word napkin is entered, auto mod is triggered since the word nap is inside of napkin. Now when we join the word Tesla with another word, auto mod isn't triggered since the exact word Tesla wasn't found in the message. To remove a word from the banned word list, click on the X next to the word. To clear the entire banned word list, click on the trash can icon. You cannot add words less than two characters to the banned words list. If you try, you'll receive this error. To add multiple words to the banned list at once, add a comma between each of the words, as shown on screen. The link blacklist option will remove specified links from chat. The link whitelist option will only allow specified links in chat and will delete all other links that aren't on the list. In order for this feature to work, you must have the all links filter option disabled. To add a link, enter your link into the add new field, then click on the create option button. You can either continue to add more links or hit save to add the links to the list. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe.